Hi, in this video we're going to look at uh, area ratio given a length ratio. So it says find the area ratio of the corresponding length ratio. A is 1 to 2 and B is 2 to 3. What we should do is draw a square of 1 by 1 and a square of 2 by 2. There's 1 by 1, 1 and there's a 2 by 2. So the length ratio is going to be, well this one is 1 and this one's 2. So this length is 1 and this length is 2. What's the area of this square? Well, the area of this square is going to be 1 times 1, which we can write as 1 squared, which is equal to 1. And the area of this square is going to be 2 by 2, which is 2 squared, which is 4. So the area ratio is 1 to 4. And you can notice you can get that by doing 1 squared to 2 squared. So the area ratio is 1 squared to 2 squared, which is 1 to 4. If we take the next example, which is 2 to 3, so draw 1 square 2 by 2, and another square 3 by 3, and do exactly the same thing. The length ratio will be 2 to 3. The area of this square here is 2 squared, which is 4. And the area of this squared here is 3 squared, which is 9. So we have a length ratio of 2 to 3, but an area ratio of 4 to 9. You'll notice if you square 2, you get 4, and if you square 3, you get 9. So the area ratio is taking the length ratio and squaring each one. So it's 2 to squared and 3 squared, which gives me 4 to 9. We sort of, sort of establish a general rule here. In general, if we have a length ratio of m to n, then the area ratio will be m squared to n squared, as we can see very clearly in this last example. OK, this has been a video to show you how to find an area ratio given a length ratio. I hope you understand, and I thank you very much for watching.